when I thought we were gonna get out of the cave. Enough of the cameraman zooming in on Shino and thighs, them booty cheeks. What happens? We stay in the cave again and we just fucking talk more and more. And we're just rizzing each other up. And the cameraman just slowly panic through Shino's body, man. And the cuck quadro. Sorry, the, the cuck quattro, right? Yes. Asuna pretty much already left, right? And, right, we have the, uh, the whole guess about who Death Gun is. We were almost there, right? My guess about who Death Gun could have been was like somehow related to the medical student kid and someone from the Daffin Coffin that obviously is obvious, but it's like I think there was like multiple Death Guns that took up the title. What I didn't understand is that medical school kid is also Death Gun outside and that's how they kill the people. That's actually pretty genius. I don't think this is a bullshit answer either. The whole thing has been hinted from the beginning. The fucking ceremony little thing here. This is to, tr you know, basically send a signal so that that guy can I inject the syringe. And then what happens? Th because they're all fucking neats that don't have anyone that they love. So no one's going to check on them if they're fucking still living. By the time their bodies decompose, you know, they can never know who, what even happened. The autopsy report won't even show, right? It's pretty fucking genius. Now, we are reaching the end of SAO part two, I believe. 13, 14, and then it's over, right? So we have three episodes left, including this one. Hopefully, Zaza shows up. Maybe he doesn't. Let's begin today's reaction. Yami Kaze. That's not Zaza. Where's uh, Sterben? They're hiding. Is Kaede still alive? Six left. What? Yeah, he's at Shino's place right now with the syringe. I don't understand. What 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 was his math? We are missing something big right now. What the fuck the fuck is going on right now? There's 30, right? There there's adding Shino and Death King comes 28. Pale Rider is 29. But there's 30. And and and, and how many how, currently how many people are there left? Player counter 24. There's six people left on the map currently, right? If we include all Shino and Death Gun and Kirito, there's three others. What do you mean two survivors? 24 killed, six people left. Twenty-four people left, two survivors. Adding Shino and Death Gun comes to 28. I don't even know how the fuck you get this value of 26. You're getting 24 plus two survivors, 26, plus Shino and Death Gun, 28. Is this because of Kirito not registering his name correctly? I thought the counter goes up to 30. What the fuck? I am confused on this count. This is very confusing. There were 34 in the fucking beginning. That count right there just showed 24 at the end after it updated, right? 20, 24 people has been killed, right? The survivor count now is left to six people. Six people. But then somehow he does some crazy more math from 24, add two survivors, 26. Then he adds, you know, the death gun that goes 28. Then adds Pale Rider, 29. I don't understand what the fuck he's even talking about. Like, this is very simple math, but he's making it complex. Like, what the fuck? Bullet of a phantom. Phantom bullets? What? A bullet from a ghost. The missing person. The thing Kirito was suspicious of. Maybe one more. Phantom. We're yapping again. Not in the cave. A little bit outside the cave, though. Uh oh. He's protecting us so that he can save us for the end. Who the fuck is Yamikaze? Why is he hyped up? How she know that Yamikaze is UAV Show Kirito? Second place. Agi build. Basically, rushdown style. Hey, I mean, if he's gonna run gun, we're just gonna run blade. Oh, that's him on the left? Zexid is right, right? Run gun is on the left? Is that him? Yeah, it is him. Okay. <laughs> Wait! He's in the middle here? People are shooting him! And he's just like... There's like 10 dudes around. Just shooting point blank. And bro's like... So cool. Maybe he also shot the gun while fucking doing like that, bro. Yeah, 
Yeah, I mean, that kid is really just watching you in bed right now. Unless there's multiple other people and we're assuming that it's only the medical kid that that's doing this shit. Sure, let's do it. And then we go for the flank. I'm down. But the fuck would be not use Yamikaze's decoy. Fuck him. Hmm? The one that's off. Hmm. Maybe he did. This is Phantom? でも考えてみるとちょっとってから次に君を撃とうとするまで30分しか経っていないつまり30分の圏内だってことだからかなファーイシ。Multiple kind of partners, so we should not be assuming it's just a medical school kid. Multiple other people could be at the apartments right now. Okay. Who could they be? <laughs> Is it Asna? Asna did leave. What alimony does she have, bro? Is it alibi? Alimony. What's alimony? A alimony is the thing that you pay when you're divorced, right? A a alimony. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> child support. A alimony is like child support. <laughs> <laughs> wrong word, wrong word, wrong word. Alibi, alibi, alibi. <laughs> Asuna, okay, okay, okay. Asuna might be still doing this so that she can earn the fucking alimony though. I don't know. And she's fucking mad right now, right? Hey, hey, she has no fucking alibi either. Maybe she's trying to fucking collect that alimony by fucking, you know, killing. I don't know. <laughs> Oh, Kirito right now is a target of Asna. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Can you still bait Yamikaze? Even though, you know, it's a, he could die. Do you have the resolve to kill Shino? Could be, yeah, four people, five people. If the nurse is also death gun, that would be insane. Especially because we had that one episode where the nurse and us literally had a heart to heart talking about the trauma. Hey, girl. Tiffany, where has he been? Where has he been all this season, bro? He's been awfully fucking quiet. Hmm. What if he was secretly a laughing cop member in SAO the entire time we didn't even know? It would be crazy. Why are you asking Death Gun people? Because they want to keep living in that reality. Yeah, but PK in a game is different from killing in real life. <laughs> what? So you compare, you're saying like murderers in real life don't have the fucking honor and glory of a fucking PKer in a game? Yeah, I agree, but it's just so funny how serious you're taking fucking PKing in a game like in some noble pursuit. It's like, disgraceful. No honor. How dare you tarnish us fucking PKers and GGO. You're right about that. It's just funny, the comparison. <laughs> Here's a fucking fun idea. How about you stop playing these VR MMO games where you have to fucking use a headset to log in because I think there's a common pattern here. Every time motherfuckers die in game and die in real life is usually because they're playing these VR MMO fucking putting that fucking gear and being unconscious while your body has no security. Bro, just stop playing the fucking VR MMOs. Can someone fucking regulate these games? <laughs> This is his path to atonement. Man, we are still fucking yapping. I swear to God, if this entire episode is also another fucking yap, and the next two is how it ends, bro. Aibo. This is a ship. Better than Asuna. Oh, people were gonna be mad, bro. The funniest thing is Asuna also changed her hair blue. But Shino is like proving that she's the better blue haired waifu in this season. It's not fair though, because like she. Asuna hasn't had a fucking chance. She wasn't even like. She's not even present in this season, other than just being cucked here and there, right? It's all just Shino and you know hype, but. 
Shinon has delivered on that hut. Shinon has a great character. Doesn't just fold over Kirito. Actually is independent. Asuna's great too, but these are the reasons why you know Shinon's also great. Shoot him right now. End him. Guys, saying Asuna can cook is not a fucking good That's objectifying woman in my opinion. Not very cool. That bitch only good for the fucking sandwich, bro. That sandwich fucking mid. It was better in SAO. Now without the fucking cooking level 99 in SAO in real life cooking. She in no, episode one, season two in the park bench, she cooked for us, right? She she had a sandwich there, I think. One opportunity! Knees weak! Palm sweaty! Mom's spaghetti! Come on, Hecate 2! Don't betray me, Hecate 2! Hmm? The fuck is this? Bro got the fucking Turtle Beaches on. You know what a Turtle Beach headset is? Back in the day in fucking Xbox 360 Modern Warfare 2 days, there's these things called Turtle Beach headset where it's like headphones where you can hear people's footsteps loudly so you can figure out where they are. <laughs> did he do this before? I thought he just did fucking vision, but he's like hearing the footsteps, right? The power of a dex build, all agi. He's way too fast. No, we wait. Wait for him to kind of stop. Hold. What are you doing, Kirito? In a video game? How the fuck do you... If it was real, I... VR MMO. VR MMO. It's not like you're playing a fucking character. You're, you're in the game. Dealing the killing intent in the VR MMO works. I love that little bell chime. You hear that quite often in the SAO soundtracks. Zaza! Zaza! Ah, still no faves. You just see skull like teeth, bro. That clearly is Death Gun, but is his name Zaza? Woo! Damn! Clearly. Oh my god, bro. Look at the power of that bullet. Yamikaze. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, it's Yamikaze? Okay. I thought it was like a. Here! Let me get it out! Yamikaze is dead! One shot! Soge King! Yamikaze was the biggest fucking L, bro! He just got one shot! Bullet on bullet clash! Bullet on bullet clash! Oh! Yeah! Damn! Damn! The same tension when I felt when watching High School of the Dead. Sniping off of race titties. The bullet fucking traversing the thighs and the booba of Psycho, bro. Holy shit. Oh, Hecate 2! The scope is gone! Oh, one for one. Okay, okay, okay. Now he has no snipe. But Hecate still works. <laughs> This is a high time check, though. You have a blade? <laughs> the fuck is that shit? He pulled the heat clip? Huh? The f- Asuna. Why is Asuna going up to the hospital? To make sure that Kirito could be safe. The nurse being Death Gun doesn't make sense. But what if Death Gun took out the nurse and Death Gun is right now pointing something towards Kirito? And now Asuna will show up, then save Kirito, and this is how she's useful in this season? I don't know. We can just talk to Yui on phone like this now? 
Okay. So that's me. You, how, do, how do you have the hospital mapped up? You're in a fucking game. In, in, in ALO, I understand when you fucking cheat every fucking thing. But like, how, how do you have the whole layout of the fucking hospital now? Like, what the fuck, Yui? Yui like transcends the game and is now just a fucking... She just knows everything in IRL too, okay? Okay, no, not death gun. No death gun. Can the desert to have the key? Oh shit, that's his in-game name. His real name was Kazuto, that's right. Anything happened to Kazuto? He's about to reach his fucking Demon Slayer mark, bro. 200 BPM, 102 Celsius. How are you doing this, Yui? How do you have access to the hospital tech? There's no way you can just do this, Yui, but she can. Oh no, even Kirito's name tag is fucking falling off. You didn't know? I thought they converted his avatar and she wanted him to look like a femboy, but anyways. A stock? Type of sword blade? Used by laughing coffin. Zaza! Zaza Steven! No, not Steven! No, not Steven! Show me Zaza! What's his name, Yui? What's his name, Yui? Death. I know, but his SAO name. They actually use Sturban, the German name for death, in hospitals like that? Okay. This has gone from GGO to back to SAO, bro. Why would a nurse not know what a Sturban is, bro? She works at the hospital. Yeah, he likes some heavy swords, apparently. Do you got a sword for me, bro? What are you saying? True? The real world right there. Ah, you've lost that touch, that killing touch. While you've been happy attending SAO school and, you know, fucking around in real life. I've been training the way of the gun and the blade, still being a cruel, merciless killer, is he saying? Kirito's watched? He definitely is. <laughs> Does he count as a super senior? Is Kirit is Death Gun a super senior? Because like SAO is over, bro. Get fucking over it. <laughs> but he still can't. He still has the Laughing Coffin fucking in a different game. Is the Laughing Coffin even a guild in GGO? He just has the mark for fucking fucking being super senior shit, bro. Back in my day, where's my hug? Yeah, the glory days. Yeah. I always wondered this. This this uh fucking mask breathing here, it's always so cool to me. But what is it actually because it's just the mask is he just breathing hard? I, what, what, Cause like I love the animation of the air coming out of the mask, but like what, what is this the like Dark Vader shit? Like what the fuck? You're fucking just playing a fucking charade. Yep. Yep, coward. Why don't you actually kill them, bro? You're not a real killer. Then we should also have Zaza. The end of Zaza, if it actually is Zaza? I won't do it. I might! I've been yelling Zaza from the fucking beginning! Not even in season 2, season 1! Because Heathcliff showing the fucking menu of the, the people logging out. Zaza was there, but there was multiple other names there. Zaza was just the one that I fixated on. This guy's name probably isn't even is Zaza. I've, been, I've just spent it, like the entire fucking season just yelling Zaza for no reason. Imagine how funny that would be if this was never Zaza. It's just someone else and I'm like, well, it is what it is. <laughs> forgot the reason why he forgot? What the fuck <laughs> forgotception is this? Okay, sure. 
This gotta be the dumbest fucking line in anime history. You don't know my name. That's why you can't remember it. Well, no shit, dude. People die when they're killed. Holy shit. These are some next level revelations we're having. Well, jokes aside, the biggest revelation is the fact that Kirito didn't want to even ask for his name. I understand that part, but it's like they play this hype music, right? They play this fucking hype music to make us seem so important. Holy <laughs> shit, this is blowing my mind, man. <laughs> and remember, there's still Phantom that could be around here, right? I don't know how much damage he's taking, but it should be okay. So we're at, an, on a, we're at a disadvantage. <laughs> Kirito, bro, do something! All right, that's the episode. Half the episode was just a shitload of fucking yapping. But then there were some important things. Like, we're off by one right now. There could be a phantom that's still in play, which could come in clutch next episode. I'm not really following who this phantom could be, but keep that in mind. There's still a missing person that might be around, or maybe I'm crazy. The other stuff was just basically the battle... Dude, Yamikaze just got destroyed so fucking quickly. I, it, it is what it is. Asuna's not Death Gun, obviously. And then Kirito starting to fight Death Gun. It's getting pretty fucking hype. And his secret identity. It's like, who could he be? What is his name? Maybe I knew him as SAO. And then, what the fuck was it? It's like, well, shit, he never fucking knew. That's why he can't remember the fucking name. Are you fucking serious? Are you fucking serious, dude? I've been yelling Zaza since season one just because I like the way it sounds and refers to the Satan's cabbage, which I adore. But like, God fucking damn, if his name's not Zaza, I'm gonna look like the biggest fucking idiot. But if it's for the sake of content, it is what it is. I'll die on this fucking hill. That's it from me. If you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.